All right, how are you? So today we're going to be making this spinach, just cream spinach. So we've got fresh spinach, cream, bit of garlic, and a couple of little spices. Really lovely. Welcome back to How to Cook Great. Okay, so I want to show you the type of spinach I'm using. It's quite robust. It's got big stalks on it. I mean, there are many, many types of spinach or palak maybe, but there are different types. But this is what I'm using. What you need to do is give it a nice wash because it usually has quite a lot of dirt on it and then we can get it cooked. There's total maybe five cups, but it will reduce down to pretty much nothing. So you're gonna need a fairly large skillet or pan or something because of the volume of the spinach. In there, I've got three tablespoons of olive oil. I've just put the heat on. You can use a different oil if you want. In goes one cup of onion sliced, one tablespoon of chopped garlic. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt now. I'm gonna add a little bit of black pepper. And we're gonna throw this around in the pan for like three to four minutes. Very simple dish. Beautiful. Okay, we're gonna add optional. I've got some olives there, like four or five olives. I'm using some nice Kalamata olives, taking the stone out. We're then gonna add a teaspoon of nutmeg and two teaspoons of dried oregano or oregano. The nutmeg in there is really, really delicious. And by the way, I started this off with some olive oil. You could start it with butter if you want. Okay, spinach time. So that's been washed nicely. Like I say, you get like kind of little bits of grit and dirt on it. Above medium heat, about four to five minutes. Like I say, this is a kind of robust type one. Obviously, many of you in Europe or in America, you get a more kind of light leaf. But yeah, we're gonna go four or five minutes to break this down. It will reduce and it might give off some moisture. So you can see that the leaves have reduced right down and it's exposed the stalks. I've got a lot of stalks in there, which I love. I mean, you can take them out if you want, but I like them in there. Next up, we're gonna add some cream. Now, let's take a look. This is a thick cooking cream. I've got two cups there. It does not make any difference if you use a thick or thin cream. So you can use a heavy cream or you can use a single cream, as we would say in the UK. To that, I've got some beautiful Parmesan. About half a cup. If you wanted a little splash of white wine would be nice in this, maybe. I'm going just like this. Two minutes, just work it in. You've done it, it's really simple and beautiful. This thick cream will actually melt and reduce down as the heat goes through it. All right, there you go, that's it, super beautiful. So, what can we use that for? We can use that as a side dish, you know, maybe with some chicken or something like that. Get some pasta in there, mix it up, lovely stuff. Yeah, it's entirely up to you. Stick it on a jacket, potato, beautiful. I hope you enjoy that, keep safe, keep well. I'll see you soon, lots of love. Thank you so much for stopping by and making it to the end of the videos. If you would like to donate to me, there's a thanks button in most countries. You can give me $2 or up to $50. I need to buy a new Ferrari. Come on, help me out.